Today's video, I'm going to be using the Moroccan Oil Curl Defining Cream and the Curl Control Mousse. Let's see how it goes. I'm Lenora Santana. I'm a hairstylist and makeup artist here in Nashville, Tennessee, and I co-own a hair salon with my best friend. Let's get started. I've just shampooed my hair twice. I always do that. Unless you're gonna shampoo your hair every day, you always need to shampoo your hair twice. And you can really tell because the first time you shampoo your hair, usually it doesn't lather. If you use a shampoo that lathers, I do. And so, especially if you don't use a shampoo that lathers, go ahead and shampoo your hair twice because just promise me, pro uh, I promise you, your hair needs it. All right, and then I like to use a deep conditioner Curly hair needs more moisture than other types of hair. I don't know why, it's just naturally drier. So I use a deep conditioner. Everything I use is just listed right below. And then I follow up, I rinse that out, and then I use the Moroccan Oil Intense Hydrating Mask, and I actually leave that in. My hair is thick and soaks up the product. So I can use a lot of things in my hair, and I can, I can use more than the average bear. And so I do, I just put all the things in it. And I've been using a conditioner as like my first product in my hair for years, for 30 years. So it, it's worked very well for me. After I put the conditioner in, I just lightly uh, just plop my hair up in the turby twist, get dressed, and here I am to do my hair. So today I'm gonna use an old school favorite. I used to use Moroccan oil all the time and the smell if you've never used moroccan oil products they smell so good it i just i think it's the best they smell like heaven i will get compliments on my hair like on day one because it smells so good people will be like you smell amazing <laughs> and it's my hair so but the curl cream by itself is just not perfect for my hair and i recently noticed so i haven't used it in a long time but i recently noticed they've come out with this curl control mousse so i'm excited to try this out pair these up and see what happens so the description says that this mousse is a lightweight airy foam seals in moisture while taming curls and encouraging separation without leaving a sticky residue argon oil infused formula enhances shine and eliminates frizz for all your curl conditioning defining and reactivating needs discover the entire moroccan oil curl collection all right and then the curl cream it says it defines and enhances the appearance of curls argon oil infused formula increases bounce and movement while improving curl pattern so I like to start with products on my ends first. And so I'm going to lightly gloss or glaze this all over on my ends. You don't just take products and go, you don't do that. You lightly do the products all over and then you start working it in. And then I'm gonna come back and get more products and put that on the hair closer to my scalp and then work that in. Lightly put that all over the hair closer to my scalp and then work that through. And so it'll eventually get all the hair from my roots, my mid shafts to my ends. And you want all the hair to have product because you want curl definition, no, no frizz, shine manageability throughout your whole head. And if at the end, you have a frizzy spot, it means you missed a spot. And I will go months with like a frizzy spot and it means I, I am consistently missing that area. And then after you've lightly distributed the product, you're gonna ribbon your fingers together and work this product through your hair. It feels great, it has a good slip to it, and it's not sticky.
So just like before, once you've worked that through, then you ribbon your fingers together, ribbon this through your hair, and then scrunch it in. You can hear the squish. You wanna hear that? If your hair has dried out a little too much in the whole process, go run your fingers under your sink and just get them wet and then literally just squish some water in like this. I do that every now and then. Sometimes it takes me too long to get from my bathroom to in here. It feels like a lot of product in my hair. I hope I didn't use too much. And when you diffuse, you're gonna scrunch your hair. Scrunching is simply squeezing. Some people have a specific particular technique and they'll define their curls, pull their curls out, spin them around. I don't have to do that with my hair, so I don't, but you can. It's just whatever you wanna do. I just squeeze it, no rhyme or reason, but I do scrunch the entire time. So scrunching, squeezing, it's the same thing. I scrunch it the entire time and I get the best results when I do that. When I don't scrunch it the entire time, my curls are not as big and voluminous and loopy and pretty. So I encourage you to give it a try. Sometimes it's a pain doing it, but I get better curls from it. I use an Ionic hair dryer. You don't have to use a specific hair dryer. Any Ionic hair dryer will do. But the reason you need an Ionic hair dryer is because an Ionic dryer dries your hair with negatively charged ions. Frizzy hair has positive charged ions. We don't want any frizz. So we wanna use the Ionic hair dryer that eradicates the positive ions and gets rid of the frizz. They sell Ionic hair dryers everywhere. Um, and I use medium heat because I like it. I don't know that that is specific, but people ask about it. So I'm just gonna say I use medium heat and then I, swap, I switch to cooler just because my head gets hot. My hair is almost dry. When you scrunch it, you can feel just a little bit of dampness. And I like for it to be just a smidge damp and let it air dry. I feel like the curls are prettier. So then I like to follow up at this point with some Aerogel, give it a shake and just a little spray. And then scrunch that in. And then fingers come out into place so it can just air dry. Kind of how you want it. And at this point, I like to use my Balance Curl Volume Clips and just start clipping the hair for some volume. And then I have, I have a couple of cowlicks back here in the back, so I just randomly put some clips back here in the back and it just takes care of that. No more cowlick. All right, I'm gonna do my makeup and I'll be back. All right, let's take these clips out. Feels good, feels pretty dry, but I think it is. So let me use a little more hairspray.
And I spend some time scrunching that hairspray in because it's wet. It says it's a hairspray that thinks it's a gel or a gel that thinks it's a hairspray. And so I wanna scrunch it and scrunch it until it's dry and it's not, it hadn't dried weird. You know, I still want my curls to be free and do their thing, whatever, whatever that may be. So the Moroccan oil cream for me is kind of heavy, um, but pretty. Looks good. It did good. I've got this one curl that's kind of clumpy. I'm going to separate that. You can just pull that apart. I did this uh, last week too. Just have to be careful because you can frizz it. It's a little, it's a little frizzy, uh, but it's not bad. And if it, you do have a frizzy spot, just take your fingers and uh, run them under your sink with some water and just run some water over it. Even if it looks straight at that point, it will dry and be perfect. You'll never even see it again. It's amazing. The thing I do love about this is I know I'm about to say this. I tend to get my hair too big. What? <laughs> so my hair is not too big today. I've at one point in my life had to make the rule, I've said this before, that my hair cannot go past my shoulders because I have I've made my hair that big before. The next day my hair was too flat and I ended up shampooing it. So my overall conclusion is these products are too heavy for my hair, but you know I'm tempted to maybe just try the mousse by itself. I've started watching Sex in the City. I've never watched it before, but oh my word, Carrie Bradshaw's hair. <laughs> Sarah Jessica Parker. Her hair on that TV show, Ooh, it is amazing. I like it, it's good. Give it one more spray for good luck. And I'm having a great hair day, I hope you do too. It really helps me out if you will play my videos on repeat all night long, I would greatly appreciate that. And also if you would just click on one of my affiliate links, you don't even have to buy anything, but just clicking on them is really, really helpful. And I appreciate that, please like and subscribe, and I will see you next time.